girl alicia pink and welcome back to my channel but if you are new here welcome to my channel okay cancers this is your reading um cancers what i need you to do is take three deep breaths ask your angels ask your spirit guides your ancestors what is the energy that's going to be surrounding me for the week of december the 8th to tuesday december the 15th okay guys so while you're doing that, I'm going to shuffle these cords, okay? And I'm going to ask my angels and my guides, what is the energy that is surrounding my cancers this week, okay? And I'm going to pick one oracle deck for the overall energy. Okay, this one came out and you have raindrops. Take a chance on them, okay? raindrops take a chance on them okay clarification for raindrops okay yeah you're working hard i see that what is the energy surrounding cancers this week okay you have the the um princess of cups as well as three of swords the hermit card Hmm, cancers, cancers. There's too many cards that came out at once. Okay, my cancers. The Will of Fortune, and you also have the Chariot, and you have this. Um, this and this and the tower this is the extra i mean the swords and you have the tower so that's the extra little card for you so cancers you already know i know you guys are emotional sign you know and like i said it says raindrops take a chance on them you know so try to you know rain is powerful it's very magical magical to do you know if you're feeling down and feeling sad go out in the rain and just cleanse yourself in in the rain and 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 cry your little lovely heart out if you need to i see that you are still trying to build your craft hone hone in your craft this is something that is very new for you you're probably working on self working on your self-esteem you've probably been getting hurt lately probably been going you've probably just been through a trying relationship tough time breakup okay you're you will get better okay you know um the will of fortune you know is luck card is up so your luck is most definitely going to be changing look like you are moving on to new bigger and better things and then you also have the queen of wands this is you baby this is you okay you are extremely loving caring and um you are the queen you know people love to be around you you just have this nourishment type of energy surrounding you you know and the things that are happening Happening, you know by the end of this week it's probably most definitely out of your control you probably feel beat up let down miserable probably a little depressed but it's okay to seek help if you need to but also 10 also stands for endings and new beginnings so please just please don't focus on the negative always always focus on the positive always focus on things that you want not things you don't want okay cancers i'm going to get some clarification cards for my cancers all right cancers let's get clarification for eight of this clarification for eight of this for my cancers clarification for eight of this oopsie it's too many cards coming out at once I just need one card spirit. Clarification for eight of disc. Clarification for eight of disc. One card. Clarification for eight of disc. Okay, we got one card, and that is the five of wands. You know, yeah, you feel like probably feel like you have to prove yourself. You probably feel like, okay, like you know um i'm working hard i'm not seeing the benefits of my hard labor you know i'm still working hard and i have to prove myself i have to prove that this is going to work i have to prove that um 
what I'm working on is going to succeed. It's going to happen. I need to prove myself. I need to prove people wrong. You probably feel like you have to prove certain people wrong, but you don't need to do that. You don't need to do that. Stop focusing on what other people think about you. Stop focusing on um, if it's going to work out or not, you know, because hard work always, always pays off and you just need to do it because you love to do it. Don't do it to try to prove or please others. Okay, let's get some clarification for the Princess of Cups. Clarification for the Princess of Cups. All right, you have the Magician card. Okay, man. Yes, you are most definitely a, the a, the creator of your own reality. You need to remind yourself that that I am I am a, the creator of my own reality. You need to to realize how powerful you really are. We are all powerful spiritual beings. Okay. We all are creators of our own reality. We run this ish, okay? Nobody runs your life but you, period. And you need to remind yourself that. All right, let's get some clarification for Three of Cups. I mean, Three of Swords. Clarification for Three of Swords. Okay, two, you got two cards. I'm going to take them. I feel like, yes, this is you most definitely. This is beautiful. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. I'm loving this. This is you, okay, getting over whatever heartbreak or whatever you're going through. Moving on. You're moving on to bigger and better things. And this is you alone, starting your new journey, getting your money, okay? Because you could do that all by yourself. All right, let's get some more clarification for the hermit card okay you have the page of swords yeah this is you this is you okay page of swords you are ready to slay that dragon okay slay it all you're done okay you're ready to slay the dragon you have done the inner work you've taken time for yourself now you're ready to to fight you ready to keep pressing on. Let's get some clarification for the Wheel of Fortune. Clarification for the Wheel of Fortune. All right, two cards came out. I guess I'm going to take it. Like, yeah, this is you. For, yeah, you, you're, you, this, you know, life is all about ups and downs, okay? Sometimes we're going to be, you know, up. Sometimes we're going to be sad, you know, but it's okay, we all have battles that we are facing. No one is perfect. You know, but baby, look. The queen is here. Here for you. And, you know, your blessings is most definitely on its way. You are a beautiful queen. Remember that. You're beautiful. I am beautiful. Say that with me. I am beautiful. I am beautiful. Okay? And let's get some more clarification for the chariot. Clarification for the chariot. Okay. All right. Everything is just coming out in twos. <laughs> With this chariot. Okay. Look, I feel like because, you know, the chariot, this is a movement card. This is moving on, things like that. So, with this chariot, I feel like, you know, it's probably going to be hard for you to do this big move because this is a big move for you. But if you make this big move, guess what? Abundance is on its way to you. Hello? Abundance, 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 success, family, all that good stuff. Take the leap of faith, okay? Clarification for Queen of Wands. Clarification for Queen of Wands. All right. I'm just going to go with this. Seven of Cups. Yes, baby. You got um a lot of, you know, um options. A lot of options coming your way. All right, and you, you're good. You're good. Okay, clarification for the tower card. Clarification for the tower card. Clarification for the tower card. Clarification. Okay, you got. All right, so yeah, you got the seven of cups, and you, you, you got the seven of swords, and you got the full card. Oh my god, crazy. So basically, it's people in your corner. I don't know if this is somebody that you just got out of a relationship with or friends, fake friends or family that's in your corner that that's doubting you. That is probably sending negative energy your way. Probably think you are a fool. 
for sure probably think you're a fool probably jealous of you and that's why all this stuff is happening right now for you baby that's crazy you need to weed out the negative people in your life you need to realize that you're good and that everyone that's smiling your face isn't always isn't always um your friend and that's okay you know everybody in this world is not gonna like you it is what it is you know but um we're not here to be, we're not here to be put on the earth for people to like us we're here to live our best lives be happy um we are spiritual beings having a human experience remind yourself that that you are and you are beautiful you are desirable you need no one and whoever is um shooting the, that negative energy towards you just send it right back to them you can always do a reversal candle spell send it right back to them look up reversal candle spell okay anybody that's out here sending negative energy to you send it right back right back Okay, let's get some clarification, some affirmations for my cancers, okay? You got, I'm open. Okay, one more. One more. Well, two more, actually. You got, I am a creator. And what is this one? You got, I am perceptive. Okay, cancers. All right. So... I am open. Vulnerability is my strength, not my weakness. My openness attracts those who are beneficial to my highest good. When I lean into my feelings, I am honoring my truth. When I communicate my feelings in a loving way, I'm speaking my truth. I am open. I am a creator. Everything around me began as a thought. My clothes, my home, and even the roads I drive on were once just thoughts. When I take the time to contemplate my surroundings, I grasp all of the thoughts that took place to create the world. Likewise, my thoughts have created things. My thoughts create my actions and thereby create my life as I know it. Therefore, I strive and strive to think about my desires. Optimistically, I am a creator. And then you have, I am perceptive. My intuition is powerful. When I am unsure, my intuition is sure. I strengthen my, I strengthen my intuition by trusting it and responding to its impulses. I am perceptive. Okay. Oh my God. So you have, I'm going to pull this card out. I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. Let's get one more card, two more cards for you, um, cancers. All right, and then you have when I accept love of the universe as my primary teacher, I will always be guided back to the light. Let's get one more for my cancers. One more. Then you have, I am unapologetic about what I desire and trust that what I focus on will grow. All right. Yes. Where your attention goes, your energy flows. Remember that. Remember that. Okay. Let's get um, some more affirmations. At least one overall affirmation for you. Energy was going on with your Aries. I mean, Cancers. Why did I say Aries? I don't know. But Cancers. Okay, so you got power. I like that power. Okay, I am strong. I am grounded. I am powerful. I am like a cross between a dinosaur and a tank, but not a tank that is used for war. I am like a peaceful, loving dino tank who feels so strong it doesn't need <laughs> it doesn't need to do anything but be. Okay, you are powerful. Remember that cancers you are powerful that is your reading i hope it resonated with you don't forget to like comment subscribe down below also um 
follow your girl on Instagram as well as if you want a personal reading from me everything is in the link down below it's on my Etsy shop contact me via Etsy and also um, I am still having my virtual vision board party tickets are in on my Etsy shop is also on evenbites.com so you can purchase tickets there so yeah guys thank you guys for watching and I will see you next video peace Thank you.